Next we're going to do palpation at the shoulder complex. Uh, first we're going to do the anterior landmarks. Uh, we're going to start here at the uh, sternal notch, um, right between the two clavicle bones and at the top of the sternum. Uh, next to that we have the sternoclavicular uh, uh, joint uh, and uh, ligament. Uh, just below that we have the, the first rib um, going along the clavicle here. Again we're feeling for any deformities or, or fractured or discomfortness. Once we get to the lateral side of the clavicle we have the uh, acromion, acromion process. And again we have a chromium clavicular joint between there and a ligament. Um, uh, just below or about one inch down from the acromion process is the coracoid process. Um, and also uh, we can palpate the, the humerus. Again for any fractures or the glenohumeral joint as, as well. Um, um, go ahead and um, go the posteriorly. Again, we'll do um, our bony structures. Again, kind of coming from our chromium process, we have the spine of our scapula. And then that goes down to our uh, medial border of the scapula. Down to the bottom of our scapula is our inferior border. We have our lateral border of the scapula, uh, infra <laughs> infraspinatus fossa is located below the spine, the flat part of the bone, and then the supraspinatus uh, fossa is superior to the spine. Again, there, there are also muscles on those as well with the same names. Another thing that we can um, uh, palpate as far as uh, soft tissue, uh, we can palpate the, the deltoid uh, muscles as it goes over the shoulders. Um, we also have our uh, rhomboid muscles um, uh, and our um, latissimus dorsi muscles that we can palpate here posteriorly. Um, go ahead and turn uh, anteriorly for them. Uh, we also have our um, pectoralis muscles here, and we have our uh, rotator mu cuff muscles which attach up, up here, another landmark that I forgot to mention, um, let me turn laterally, is our, uh, right up here is our uh, head of the humerus, and real close there is our um, greater tubercle. And then our lesser tubercle is just below that. And then between that is our inner trabecular groove. And through that is our, uh, the long head of our, our uh, biceps brachii muscle. And then we also have our um, deltoid tubercle down here where our deltoid muscles uh, attach onto the, the humerus. We also have uh, just anterior to the acromion process, we have the subacromion bursa, which could be uh, inflamed for um, bursitis. Uh, we also have the um, axilla underneath the, the arm and uh, the armpit, and we have the, the four borders there. Uh, the uh, uh, latissimus dorsi f forms one border, the pectoralis major, serratus anterioris, and the uh, um, um, the ribs all form that. With within the top of the uh, axilla, uh, we have a, 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 um, the lymph nodes that we can palpate if they're inflamed. 
um, and also um, an artery is up in there. So, and that's it for 